Welcome to Symbol Tech Working Bench. Welcome back, guys, to Symbol Tech Bench work again. So yesterday was uh, my working day off, and I was planning to go further with my home automation uh, system uh, project, but I couldn't because still. They didn't show up in the mail some components and still I need to order some um, some PCB boards like this board I projected and I need to order it and to be shipped back to me so this one I have and I have also designed this one so this one it will gonna be the sensor Sensor module where I have an Arduino <coughs> Pro Micro NRF power supply 5 volts uh, relay that turn, in, turn on and off the light, some capacitors, a transistor that controls the relay. Here I have my card reader, so it's gonna be the RFID card reader on this side and on this side I'm gonna have <coughs> the Arduino Uno with one relay if I want to make also the electric uh, open door the same a transistor a relay resistors to control those three lights over there three LEDs so a LED, green, yellow and red because of that one I couldn't go over with my project also because I'm still waiting those components from Aliexpress to come in the mail so let me show you which are they so I'm still waiting a few components to arrive I'm gonna go through now to show you which one are those So I need to receive these capacitors to solder them in place. So I ordered a few of those that they didn't show up yet in the mail. A few of those. I'm still waiting for them. So those capacitors. these uh, fuse holders for my power supply uh, PCB board so they didn't show up yet so I'm still waiting for them I'm still waiting also few triacs because as I say I want to prototype and try to make it also dimming the lights not just turn on and off so we still need also these capacitors here I order a few of them and I need all these pumps like Triax MOC3021 and MOC3061 I still need to receive also some uh, octocouplers so because of that reason I couldn't go over with my with my project a few stuff here and I need to receive ah, also because I am waiting also this relay for the mo uh, sensor module because of that I couldn't go over so I'm still waiting these components but instead of that yesterday I was off 
and I did uh, because I'm new on YouTube so my channel is very fresh so I say why not to make a YouTube subscriber counter and I started with that one yesterday and everything what I needed for that project the YouTube uh, subscriber counter is an RGB LED just this one few resistors the buzzer one stuff line uh, header header pins a prototyping board just to solder everything in place an OLED display Uh, not MCU 8266 and then I solder all this stuff in place and comes like that so all the connection with wire between all the stuff here what I solder in place and then when I put all together we're gonna give also a try so this place goes here the buzzer goes in here Oops, up and down like that buzzer goes here Put inside. Okay, that's the buzzer. It goes there. Maybe it needs to go opposite. Just a second. So the buzzer goes here. Okay. And ESP3 8266. Now the MCU goes here on the back. And as I said, I soldered the LED and the resistor and then I also build an enclosure for this You can use some plywood, so this is the enclosure and this is the back side So let's power it here and let's see how it works So this one needs to go inside over here. It's almost fit. That goes perfectly. And I can see it's perfectly here. Then if I get a a power bank to power it we're gonna see how that works so we're gonna just power it here you can see it's flashing the lid and it's telling you connecting to youtube channel to my channel and it's going to connect to my youtube channel and get the data from subscribers so you need like one minute like that to get over there so let's wait uh, and now it shows me the the youtube subscribers so i have for the moment 35 and i'm gonna show you also on my youtube channel to be sure that this number matching the youtube channel so let's see now if my YouTube channel shows the same number that my small YouTube uh, subscriber counter is doing. So if I click on YouTube Studio, then 
display me the subscribers. So my subscribers are exactly 35. And when I start this uh, project it was yesterday. Yesterday I had 28 one. So I have a small video when I when I upload the code and I start I, I try it and it was show me the 28 uh, subscriber and just leaving like that once the subscriber come is displayed straight away to my to my uh, YouTube subscriber gadget that I, I build it so guys this is the video from yesterday when I was building my my small gadget so you can see yesterday I had just uh, 28 uh, subscribers so from yesterday till today I can see that uh, the number increased so I'm up to 35 and I'm I'm gonna say a big thanks to those that are subscribing to my channel and that's supporting me because if you subscribe and also push the notification bell you encourage me that uh, I can do more stuff and to post more videos and so on and feel free if you might need to know how to build this one just leave your comment below and I'm gonna be more than happy to answer all your questions and help you with support how to build this project. And for this occasion maybe this small gadget that I built we're gonna stay always here now from now and then every single moment I'm gonna make the new videos and it will gonna show me my subscribers all the time I can bring it more in zoom in like that you can see the numbers so yeah please subscribe stay tuned I have a lots of other projects coming in soon because as you can see in my my bench I am missing a power supply so I'm planning to build one because I have a really good transformer over here I'm gonna just show it as this one and with this one I'm gonna make my power supply bench so stay tuned more videos and more project coming in don't forget to subscribe, like my video, and if you also ring the, uh, if you click the the bell, notification bell, you're gonna be always receiving notification when I am posting new videos. Thank you guys. See you for the next video.